Welcome back to Prey. I'm about to go try to do the treasure hunt quest from Abigail involving all those treasure maps. But before that, when I was going over to the crew quarters, a I think it's a Voltaic Phantom just popped up and is chasing me. So as soon as I unpause, I'm going to enter combat time and shoot it in the face with a shotgun. Okay. So it sounds like if I just take the maps to her workstation, that then I might gain access to whatever the treasure is, I think. Let's try it. So I've done all that, is there... Oh. Okay, so I need to figure out some sort of a passcode. Well, obviously there's four digits, and I believe there's four treasure maps. It mentions four treasure maps. So I guess each one has one digit. Um, let's take a look. Okay, so I'm pretty stumped on this. I don't know how to solve this. I've noticed some details, but they're not coalescing into a solution. So obviously I have four treasure maps, and I needed to get them all to do the quest. So obviously the treasure maps themselves have the clue. Um, and each one presumably would have one digit of the four digit code. So I've noticed two things about them. One is that most, well, maybe not most, some of the maps seem to have something that you could, some distinct thing that you could count. Like for example, I don't know what these are, but there's two like triangles, right? And if we go down to another one. Uh, that's the one example that doesn't have it. I guess this one sort of maybe does? It's got these two things, or these four dots, like, I don't know, they kind of stand out? I'm sort of reaching here. But this one really stands out, right? Like, there's these three circles. That super stands out. So I've noticed that. Are you supposed to count those? I don't know, it seems inconsistent, because, again, two of them don't really have any. One of them doesn't have anything to count at all, and the other one has kind of two things that you could vaguely count. Okay, other thing I've noticed is that there's obviously numbers written on them. So, um, one says L1, one says L2, this one says B2, and then one says, uh, I think it's the latest one. This one says EL-B. Don't know what those are supposed to be. I was thinking maybe it was telling you to order the order to put them in. Like, if each map represented a digit, then perhaps L1 was the first digit, L2 is the second, and then B2 would be presumably the last? But then, what's what's with this EL-B? There is four things, right? EL-B, that's like four digits. And maybe this is telling you this is the order they go in? You do the L, and then this one here, and then the B next? But... What is the E? There's L1 and L2. I don't quite get it. The other thing is that we see this character, this like, or this eye that's looking in a direction. So perhaps each of these treasure maps maybe corresponds to somewhere on the station. And if you look here, maybe there's some sort of a number. Like, I doubt it, though. I really doubt that. So in conclusion, I don't get it. much trouble on earth now they play with the stars and expect not to burn i wondered why you opened us to the chamber make us see a horizon sharp razored hungry you surround yourself with machines with things they cannot keep you safe they will eat you as well after they eat you Maybe I take your suit, hmm? become MU, get shuttle access. Yeah, that's not happening. 
I'm just moving around trying to see if I can find any, maybe, numbers? I did find one thing that maybe could be significant, and that's this. So Abigail Foy's place is in Crew Cabin B. So could that have anything to do with the B2 that's on the map? If that's the B, then where the hell's the L? Like, I was looking at the map to see if any of the treasure maps would correspond to anything that I see on the map here. And, I mean, just looking at the one... Um... Let's find it. Looking at the one that was super distinctive down here. The one with the three... And this one. This one says B2, and it's got three very distinctive, like, I'm assuming these are pillars or something. And I don't see that anywhere on the map here. <laughs> Unless it's in a different part of the station, but I really doubt it. It's like B2. You know, what What would B2 mean? This is B. I mean, there's pod 112. I don't think so. I think I'm reaching. I think all the information I need is in the map itself. I was also thinking maybe it has something to do with... Um, the character sheets. Because I don't just have the maps, I also have the character sheets. Let's find one. But the thing is, I don't have all the character sheets. I only have two character sheets. Yeah, like this. This is X. Like, there's all sorts of numbers on these. But... I mean... What? I was thinking maybe the L1, L2, that corresponds to something on the character sheet. But what could it correspond to? L? L1, L2? What the hell is that? It's very, very hard to read this because it's so tiny. But I don't see anything that would correspond to L or B2 or... Ah, I don't get it. Alright, so I have no idea how to solve that problem. So I'm just going to move on to some other quests, I guess, and hope something comes to mind. It probably won't. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to move on to ultimately turning in the, I think, two quests that I've finished so far. The ring and the Dr. Igwe thing. But um, I'm also going to head to the hardware labs and try to do the whole satellite thing to deal with the nightmare, now that I've got the repair skill to do it. I'm just heading back, and it looks like even just behind me, new enemies have spawned. They really are just spawning all over the place. gonna hide for a minute because my um, combat focus skill is not back up. <laughs> it makes such cool noises. I need more shotgun ammo, and my health is terrible. Oh, fuck. kind of running, I mean, I'm not low on spare parts, but I don't think I want to actually use it to repair that. I might need to use a bunch of repair parts for the satellite thing, I'm not sure. I think that we'll take phantoms down here.
All right, the journey to the hardware labs was uneventful. Just went, uh, just took the elevator to the lobby. Now entering the labs. Oh, got some new friends. A lot of new friends. I've heard that happen before. Something over there saw me? Huh. Still got the zappy thing there, right? Oh no, the power's off right now. Hmm. Let's go turn it on. Now this one I will fix, it's just hurt me too many times. Hmm? Oh, poltergeist. Alright, where you at? Oh yeah, I think I can make some stuff up here, right? Yeah. Alright, let's make some shotgun ammo. Okay, just made a bunch of ammo and some rad pills too. Ah, oh, there's another one. Thought I was hearing some creepy noises. Is there more? Oh yeah, this thing takes eight parts. Etheric shielding. Interesting. Let's take a look at that. I always forget where it is. Inventory? Yeah, inventory. And it's on the suit, good. I think I want that. What can I get rid of? Knock back. Definitely want that. Regenerate stamina, yes. Uh, maybe laser attacks. Last chance is important. That's important. These are all important. Well, I guess I'll get rid of this. Let's get rid of thermal shielding and replace it with etheric shielding. Is that it? Oh, I need to place it on the exterior. Okay. 
Let's go place it. Microgravity detected. Oh. Shit. Oh. <laughs> they went after a piece of shrapnel. There's still some left, though. If I can grab any of this, this probably requires leverage. Oh no, I can carry it. Oh, they just blew up. Any... whoa. Any more? God, so disorienting. I think we're good. Ah, this thing. The thing I tried to goo a long time ago. It's too fast! Where's it go? Ah! Uh, oh, Christ! Urgh. Come on, come on! There we go! Whew. Nice work. This should get the attention of that Typhon Nightmare that's hunting you. I'm sending you two activation signals. The first will direct the Typhon away from you. The second will bring it down on you. Use your transcribed messaging system to fire them off. What? <laughs> um... So I have it? In what, like an audio log? Yeah. Why would I want to attract the nightmare? Let's play it. a horrible noise. I don't think I want to play the Attract Nightmare. I mean, it can't come to me in space, right? Surely not. Yeah, we're fine. But if I could attract it to me, then does that mean I could just farm it and just like keep getting it again and again if I wanted to? I don't want to. I don't need the supplies, but hmm. Anyway. All right. Well, let me head back to the uh, people in the cargo bay to turn in these quests. We've arrived at the cargo bay. Hope everybody's still alive. Turrets are doing well, I hope. Such a stiff walk. Oh, let me activate both quests. Kevin Hogg and Igwe. Oh, there's Hogg. Turrets are doing well. Not even damaged. Nicole, so she didn't make it. I... you didn't have to do this, but I... Thank you, ma'am. And Morgan? I owe you an apology. Once you vanished into the sim lab, Sarah asked me to try and learn what I could from the psychotronic staff, discreetly. I took too long, but I... learned you were in the lab without your consent. I didn't even consider that possibility. When we heard 
Sarah was quick to begin action against your brother, but then... Well, things fell apart. I should have worked harder, dug deeper, especially after all you've risked for us. I'm sorry. We did it. Area secured. Igwe's all the way over there? They were here last time. I, I thought we were dead for sure. What are you doing over there, Igwe? Oh, wait. Turn life support? Oh, that's right! I forgot Igwe went to my office. Feels like that happened forever ago. Although it's really strange, the quest marker doesn't actually show up here. Like, it told me to go to the lift, but like now once I'm at the lobby, it doesn't say to go anywhere. A bit odd. Let's see if I can remember how to get there. Is it up here? Yeah. Okay. Hi, Morka. Hi. <laughs> Igwe thing's gonna be nice, but the Michaela thing, not so much. I'm just gonna try to stay as far away from her as possible right now. Morgan, Dr. Yu. Good to see a friendly face. Was worried I might not make it here myself, but my luck held out. I, I hope you don't mind, but I made use of your fabricator. I was able to gather the right materials to make several refill canisters for your glue gun. Also, if I may show you, with this kit, I think I can increase the fluid intake efficiency without detriment to the weapon's effectiveness. Here. I've been trying- Could just give me a weapon upgrade kit? <laughs> it's already maxed. Thanks, though. Trying to see what I can access from here, but most of the systems are locked down. Thank you. It's a strange feeling. I hold Lightner's gift to the world in my hands. He will live on. I wish my wife could have heard him play again. That was brave of you. To recover the connectomes for me? I... I appreciate it. I appreciate all you and Transtar have done for me. Hey, Michaela. Yeah, we got four weapon upgrade kits. Let's see if there's just anything we can do. I know the shotgun's maxed. I'm pretty sure, yep, yeah, blue gun's maxed. That thing's maxed, so I think it's just, oh. I don't think I've done the disruptor stun gun. Oh, I haven't upgraded that at all. I just never use it, but eh, what the heck. Let's get the power up. So it looks like that increased the stun duration. Okay, Michaela. I'm gonna do a quick save first. Maybe a perma save? Hold on, I gotta delete one. Can only have 20 save slots. Just in case this goes really badly or something. I mean, uh, uh, we'll see what happens. Morgan. Just like you to keep me waiting. <clears throat> you designed me to assist you. I have more instructions, but I can't access I want them for until so you long. recover both arming keys. Are you alright? The download came through, it's ready. Yes, th thank you, January. I know Alex. He always has a backup plan. He must. My office is too busy. Too many people talking. Initiating test procedure 29, variant C, subject V-010655-32. Morgan? Subject 32 is in the chamber. Psychoscope's on, everyone. Do you have a family? Prep the Typhon Cacoplasmus. I have a daughter. They took me from her. I was promised I would see her again. I signed your papers. <sighs> Let's stay focused, everyone. Your family. You must hate them very much to do this. 
I hear it in your voices. Track his vitals. 32 is showing signs of distress. Elevated cortisol, heart rate, perspiration. Nothing in the red yet. Look at me. Look at the man you're killing. Mimic is in the tube. Permission to release? Morgan? What you do kills us both. Release. Mm -hmm. Typhoon cacoplasma ah, specimen is in the chamber with subject 32. Subject, uh... Subject, vital signs are gone. Make a note. Replication followed the usual pattern. Appears unaffected by the subject's age. Morgan, did you get a good scan? Yeah. Data looks good. Scrub it and send it up to me as soon as you can. I want a new design on the mimicry connectomes before I dive into the sim again. I'll look for more neuromods while you're gone. You? Perform the procedure? The what? Killed him? And you knew? Why? And to think, Morgan... I thought you were trying to help me. Why would you save me to do... this? To buy back some guilt? So I'd forgive you? My father is right. You don't understand. Your father, mother, your stupid, deluded brother... You will never understand, family. You don't even understand what it means to be human. Is this a joke? Get the hell away from me. Well, that was about as awkward as I thought it'd be, but she didn't try to kill us. I'm tempted to try to talk to her just to see what she says, but there's... no. No, no, no. <clears throat> Perhaps the coral is a kind of reservoir of all the energy the Typhon have been accumulating. Hmm. No, I don't think so. I'd say the coral bears a striking resemblance to a nervous system. You believe the Typhon are building a disembodied mind? It's only a hunch. I had more time to study it. Studying it is what got us here in the first place. I don't... I don't understand. I've always felt that consciousness is more like... music than computation. What's happening? Who's talking to who? I think that was a conversation between Attention. all of them, but... Station th leadership has issued an <laughs> that was alert. weird. All personnel should report to muster stations immediately. Okay, well minutes. that knocked out quite a few side quests, although we still have a bunch left. Ah, I mean, some of these... Um, some of these I can't really, well, at least one of these I can't really get rid of. The mixed signals, that's just how many uses of the thing I have left. So that's not going anywhere. Disgruntled employee. Oh. Right, I never tracked them down. They're in the exterior. I should do that. I'm never going to find Josh Dalton. I mean, that's just, I'm just going to write that off. But yeah, let's go find this person. So I gotta find... Further I've activated their bracelet, exactly. but I need to find a computer that I can use to track them with. And then go to the exterior, so I'll be right back. Okay, Grant Lockwood is apparently way, way, way out in space. Definitely never would have found him without tracking him. Still don't even see him. I see him. Oh, I think they're on the border where you start to get radiation poisoning. Yeah. Maybe that's why they died. They probably died from it. Propulsion Gen 2. I think that's an upgrade. Alright, come on. Go, go, go. Ah. Oh, well, it's fine. Okay. 
Oh, it's this sad, depressing kind of music again. Uh, inventory, soup chipsets. That's Jet Boost, the Artex propulsion system. So yeah, what do I have right now? Yeah, Gen 1. Can you have Gen 1 and 2 at the same time? Uh, let's see. Okay, come on, I gotta choose something to get rid of. Okay, regenerate stamina more quickly. Yep, you can have both. So. Is it a higher top speed? No, that's the same. I don't get it. What did it do? Shift to thrust. I mean, I already could thrust. I don't get it. What did that do? Huh. How strange. Still gorgeous. So that's another quest off the optional list. There's still far too many for me to be happy though. Still don't get the treasure hunt. I still haven't found a single smuggling point. Maybe I should try to find one. Hmm. I don't think I can kill the imposter cook yet. I get the feeling based on the fact that uh, that asshole keeps talking to me and saying like I'm gonna eat you and steal your suit or whatever. <laughs> whatever the hell he said last time. Um, I get the impression from that that he's going to reappear in the main quest. I can't think of how I could possibly track him down. I don't believe he's wearing any sort of a tracking bracelet. I don't think. I also don't think I know his actual name. So I think I'm just going to wait on that one. So this one I can't do. This one I haven't done. This one I'm not sure how to do. This one I'm not sure how to do. This one I think I just have to wait for. This one just ends the game. I've already done it. So even though there's quite a few things here, there's not that much I can do. Or that I know of to do. But let me see if I can find a drop point. I'm just going to go take a look at some places. Because I remember... It was a long time ago, but I remember hearing from, I don't know, an audio log or an email or something that I know you need to hit something with a wrench three times to make it pop open. And I know it was supposed to be some sort of security panel. I think that was, I think that was a security panel, whatever that means. The strangest thing just happened. And also, I just started receiving a call. I'll tell you after the call might be related. Morning. Oh, Jean it's Murray not. was right. It was not you. But I keep hearing your voice and my father's voice and it was not you, I know. You saved me because you wanted to. That is not the same person on the recording. Something's changed. I need to see that. I'm better now. I'll do what I can to get us off the station alive, but that log is coming with me. If you truly want forgiveness, you'll help me get it to where it belongs. No matter what that means for you, Antron Star. I hope Morgan's changed. Yes, yeah, so here's a strange thing that happened. I, I still haven't found any of the smuggle points, by the way. The security panels or whatever. I've just been banging random stuff with a wrench. But anyway. Uh, when I was looking at a computer where you could track people down, I saw that... What was it? Hardware Labs? Where was it? It's on one of these pages. There it is. Life Support. In Life Support, I saw there was Bernard Griffith, and it said that they were alive. And they were in exterior maintenance, and they were in the crew quarters. I'm like, wait, I don't remember anybody being alive in the crew quarters. I thought, maybe, could that possibly be the person? The, uh, imposter? that I need to kill. So, I set them to track them, and as soon as I got here, the quest, like, failed. It disappeared. And now if you look, it doesn't say life signs of any sort. It doesn't say no life signs or life signs. It's just dot dot dot. And if I try to trigger this, it'll, like, instantly fail. Just watch. Let's 
so should I be suspicious or is that just a bug or something? Dunno. Anyway, I'm gonna keep looking for a security panel. Wait, what the heck? There's a note on the science op The science operator that just went by me, there's a note on it. Helpful supplies. Hi Penny, I sent you some goods with this operator. I hope they're helpful in your work. Please share your results with my department when you can. Thanks, Peter Coleman. <laughs> what the heck? Hmm, okay, I'm no closer to finding these security... <sighs> I'm no closer to finding these security panels. However, I did go into this cook's place, and I went into the here where I was trapped before, and this door opens. Which I hadn't been in here before, I just got some food that was on the shelves, and then I just looked over and saw this. Suspicious Meet Will Mitchell Tracking Bracelet. That's Will Mitchell. Well. <clears throat> That's disgusting. It can't be all of Will Mitchell, it's too small. Ah, I don't want to think about it. Anyway, let's just... Take a look and see what else is in here. Whoa. Oh my god. Electrostatic amp. Oh, that would just make my electric damage better, probably. Ah, Abigail. Don't think there's anything back there, but just in case. I don't think it actually helped me to find Will, Will Mitchell's bracelet. That was, that's probably just if you happened to try to track Will Mitchell down, you would have found that. Oh god, please be quiet. Oh. Okay, back to the security panel hunt. Aha! I found one! This stood out like a sore thumb once I was looking for it. By the way, this thing behind me is going to explode soon. Uh, I'm just going to repair it. Yeah. It's weird. It, I mean, it stands out now that I'm looking for it, certainly, but there's six of these. And this is the first one I found. I Like, I'm trying to think of where I've seen these before. I can't think of a single other one. I'm going to have to, like, really be on the lookout for them. Well, there's one out of six. It does get counted in a quest, right? Yeah, it was six before, now it's fine. Five more. Okay, cool. I still love this effect. Anyway, uh, I think I'm going to end this episode here. So I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, I'm going to... Good evening, Talos. Not quite sure. Maybe look for more of those. Maybe go talk to Alex, since I am here in the Arboretum, and he's in his office. But yeah, I'll be back soon.